for me, man. Yes, take a seat. What's up, guys? How you doing? Good. How's it going? As you see, we have HR here. You know, these meetings, you know, they have to be here to observe everything that go down. You know, basically witnesses. Okay. So, yeah, what's the problem? What's the problem? <laughs> Carlos, uh, we saw that your numbers, your ratings for your employees, they're actually not matching you. It seemed to be a little too generous. Look, my department reaching our goals, so... Reaching your goals? <laughs> what I'm looking at here? Look, some cuts are going to be made if some things don't change by the end of this quarter. So is that a threat, Jose? Calm down, guys. No need to get hostile. Look, Carlos, I'm the GM. I'm responsible for the numbers in the department. So if I see cuts need to be made, guess what? Cuts will be made. All right, boss. Let me go start making these numbers then. <laughs> All right, Carlos, get out of here, man. Catch me outside, didn't you? What was that, Carlos? Oh, no, I said I'll be outside. I'll be outside. So I got to deal with it. Well, I just had an intense meeting. What happened? Well, Jose and Carlos were having a meeting about the ratings not matching the, the numbers that they're putting in. Yeah. And um, Jose showed like a strong case of trying to dominate the meeting, and Carlos was being very defensive. How did Carlos get offensive at the meeting, though? It started with Jose accusing him of lying about the ratings, and then he got really hostile after that. So they had a task conflict. Yep. Did they find a compromise? No. All they did was argue and go back and forth with each other, and nobody was listening. Well, what about Carlos? He got real defensive and didn't want to hear anything Jose said, and started getting real sarcastic. Let me clarify this. Between Carlos and Jose, during the meeting, all they did was argue and made matters worse. They yep. didn't get a solution. No, nope. they just went back and forth, and... Once the topic was addressed, no one had empathy for the other and tried to hear what the other one had to say. It just kept going back and forth and it got more and more hostile. I had to break them up for a second because it got bad. Well, it looks like you got a lot to report. Just submit your notes to the system. Oh, yeah. You feel like you have to have a sit down with them and just do it. Yeah, I got a lot to write up. This is going to be a good one. Hey, Carlos. Yeah. Man, I hope I can trust you to get the job done, man. Oh, yeah, of course, man. Oh, so we good? sitting in at these meetings, you know, just, just so they can observe, you know, be witness and report it later. Yeah, I understand. How you they going so far? Yeah, man, it's going well, it's going well. What about you? It's, it's going pretty good, you know, me and the family, we went, uh, we went to the basketball game the other night. Okay. Had floor seats, so, you know. Oh, nice. Man. Right there next to LeBron's shoulder. <laughs> yeah, for real. Nice. Well, yeah, what's the meeting about then? I mean, I'm glad you asked. After looking at some of the records of your department, we just saw a few of the ratings, you know, that was, it didn't kind of match up with the sales. Okay, well, yeah, I can understand that. We, I mean, we've been working really hard, mostly on the marketing side, yeah. so I can see the sales would have fallen down a bit. No, I just want to say I appreciate that. You know, yeah. marketing, marketing does play an important role, but we just want to make sure, you know, when you're doing those ratings, they actually have to match the productivity that's actually going on. What's some of the marketing strategies that you're, you're using now? I mean, yeah, we've been, we've been uh, working on some new packages for uh, getting out mm -hmm. to the public. And uh, we really, f really feel like this quarter will be really successful for us in renewing our focus for approaching our customers. Okay, so, so you basically what you're telling me the new packages is you're basically refocusing the whole marketing strategy so you know you can basically get long term growth and renew get those renewals back in and everything. Exactly, yeah. That's why, yeah, the, the team been working really hard at making sure that the refocus is uh, just right for the for wow. people that we're going for. Okay, I mean, well, like I said, you know, that's, that's, that sounds very good, you know, I'm glad you're taking that initiative, but, you got, I mean, you got six people on your sales team, right? your sales and marketing team, uh, what if you was to divide half of them, you know, three and three, more focused on the lines of, you know, a goal that we set for the uh, for the sales and the goals that we set for marketing. Okay. You think you'd better get that done? Yeah, I think, I've, we've never tried that before, but I think that could work, definitely. Okay, well, you know, let's... Let's basically monitor everything. You know, I'll be working hands on if you need any assistance. So at the end of the quarter, we'll be able to check everything. I, I'm sure you're gonna do well. All right, appreciate it. Yeah, well, I'll definitely check that and let the team know and get back to you. Okay, man, yeah, sounds good, you know. Thank right. you, thank you. No worries, thank you. Um, Have a good night. All right, you see.
I was wondering how he's gonna take it, but you know, I feel like if I was, you know, came off more positive, you know, kind of as his day was. Uh, I just had a good meeting downstairs, but we need to debrief for records. Well, what happened? Well, uh, the ratings was not matching the numbers, what the, how they were doing it. So I try to organize a way for them to, you know, come together and like get a solution. Together. Yeah. Did anybody get offended in the meeting? No. Nah. Everybody went smooth. Everybody respected each other. They know their opinions. You know, we solved the problem, and you know we got it done. I just knew for sure it was gonna be some drama. Um, uh, they was done. They was real good employees. You know, they just come here to do their job, and that's all. Don't sound like everything went smooth. So I guess you can go ahead and write it up and get out of here. Sounds yeah. good. All right, yeah, it's about true. that time. Hey, Jose. Yeah, man. So, Carlos? Yeah, from what you were saying earlier in the meeting, I talked to the team about what you were saying with the three people in sales, three yeah, in the pocket. Yeah, of course. Yeah, they really loved the idea, man. We was thinking if you guys, if you wanted to come over.